Ever since the John Oliver episode with technology going wild, we've had two robots. I'm not a big fan of having the robots in the office. I feel like we're being spied on. So I'm gonna give you a little bit of history of the robot thing. I stumbled upon this website, which is called letsrobot.tv. We just love it. We think it's like a super interesting thing. It's just put together by people that love robotics. So the way we were able to convince Jim to buy these robots is that they'll have a use beyond the episode. We do the episode, that's all fun. And then they can just roam around the office, which meant a couple issues. I mean, in the room, we got the board with all the guest stuff. Don't, no, hey, don't look, look at me. Don't come in here, guys. I think the robots are a welcome addition to the office. They're welcome to come into my cubicle. I just ask that they please be careful with my heater. It could be a fire hazard, so just watch out for that. I'm going to be showing you guys how we robo-proof the office. So, Like most things on the show, when we have a lot to do, we decided it would be best to just have the interns do it. They just said, interns, hey, robots, do something fun with them. We used uh, a bunch of pool floaties and we pretty much just put them in front so the robots don't go into the men's room or to other people's offices. We put on, you saw earlier, all the, all the names outside their offices. Um, we also got a cool task of coming up with creative ideas, um, little maybe ideas like uh, Easter eggs, scavenger hunts. We're giving robots too much power and eventually they'll take over. I'm scared. The way the controlling works is that if there's hundreds of people all trying to control the same robot, most of the people want it to go left, it'll go left. If most of the people want it to go right, it'll go right. Don't abuse the power, I think, of the robots would be my advice. So we're super excited about the robots, but I have one warning for you. Don't go looking for things you're not ready to find. I'm not in charge of the interns. I don't give them their performance reviews. I don't know what the outcome is. I don't know when they start, when they stop. All I know is I'm super proud of them.